what's up? This is a beautiful Sunday morning. We've been getting some excellent weather lately. Some great weather. You know, I just wanted to make a video about the first time. This goes all the way back to July 2018. I want to make a video about July 2018. And this video is about the first time my uh, credit score reached 800. Now, my credit score went from 795 to 800. So June of 2018, my credit score was a 795. And then in July 2018 is when my credit score became, to eight, became a 800. Now, when it became a 800, like my score it was kind of interesting because you know when some people reach 800 credit score maybe they'll start off at like a 801 or a 802 803 804 you know one of the eights i actually started off at uh 800 which is kind of ironic you know it was kind of like the universe's way of telling me like hey you made it like my score literally was 800 on the dot you know that's what my FICO score was and it was crazy you know because I worked so hard like when I was going towards the journey of you know getting up to an 800 credit score you know I uh I was just working hard man and I was focusing on how I would get to 800 but then you know you realize after a while you're gonna get there you just don't know when so when I finally hit that 800, it was like, wow, you know, I'm really there. And, you know, it was kind of, it, it was kind of bittersweet, and which, is, which may sound kind of weird. I'll tell you why it was bittersweet. It was bittersweet because I felt like, you know, I had prior to that moment, I put in a good three years, a three good three solid years of work towards working up to that 800 credit score like there was no quick turnaround for me building up my score like I legit put in a good three years of hard work constantly every day every month just consistently putting in work on my towards my credit score and doing everything I needed to do you know the whole process of uh doing your credit the right way and and being strategic and all of that stuff you know so I have been doing that for three years so by the time I reached the finish line it wasn't like how it would be for someone who went from like a 720 to an 800 in the span of a couple of months you know they would be ecstatic because it didn't take that much effort it didn't take that much work you know but by the time I finally reached the 800 from starting in 2014, 2015, you know, I kind of felt a little exhausted. So I was kind of exhausted. So that's why it was bittersweet, but it was a great time. You know, of course, that's a big accomplishment. Now, granted, getting in the 800s is not everything, especially if you don't quote unquote, what they call it, leverage your credit. You know, you actually need to do something with that 800. Don't just get to the 800s and just have it to look pretty. You actually need to do something with it because that 800 credit score puts you in a position to better yourself financially for the short term present as well as the short term future and the far future if you do it the correct way. Because yeah, the 800 credit score is an excellent credit score. That's what FICO uh, classifies it as, excellent. So yeah, you can, uh, you'll be able to do stuff with it. So, you know, when you get to that level of an 800 score, don't just aim for 800 just to have it looking pretty like it's an award or something. Actually do something with it. But that's my story on uh, how it felt when I accomplished the 800 credit score. And I hope that you all join me with that. Be sure to like and subscribe. I thank you for listening. Water your soil.